very first time witnessing a volcano erupting. Um, what to say? Frightened, but still yet have um, keep the courage. You know, um, never seen nothing like this before. Heard of it, yes, but never know it would have been of this magnitude. Didn't expect it to be like this, really. Expecting something like just blow and then it's over with. But the kind of um, the ash, that is one of the biggest problems, really, that, that we are facing, just the ash, really. It's not nothing for the tumbling or the anything else blowing out from the volcano, but the ash, really, is, is our biggest humbug, that is it. And see, as you can see, the road is filled. Um, the house, the houses, the house stuff is filled as well. It, a lot of ashes, a lot. I see you have some guys who are cleaning off the roof. Yes, yes. Um, the thing is, I don't want to wait, and it may get worse. I'm not too sure, you know. But I, as as we have the chance now, then we can do something. Even said we have to ease up the workload, so then we do something in the meanwhile. So um, I, I imagine that last night and this morning was uh, there was a lot of ash falling, but now it, not so much and it, it, it rained a little, obviously. So are you taking advantage of this opportunity to do whatever cleanup you can? Yes, yes, I am taking advantage of this opportunity. Um, like I say, I never um, witnessed it before. I don't know what to expect as this moment go forward, but as it gave me the chance to um, do a bit of cleaning up, that's what I'm doing. All right, thanks a lot and all the best to you. No problem, buddy. All right. Here in Belle Isle in Western St. Vincent, this is the area where the green and yellow zones meet. Outside of this, one is in extreme danger from the volcano. But persons who have been trying to leave the green zone today encountered a peculiar difficulty in the roads that we have on this very mountainous side of St. Vincent. some fresh water because all the water that we fill up is finished so that is my main concern right about now did when, when was the last time you had water in your tap yesterday about what time? i can't remember i get I, I get up late yesterday do you know if any water was brought in the area at all no water was brought in our area. Not yesterday, nor today. No water. We need some water right about now. Fresh, fresh, clean water we want. My barrel empty right now. I me get all my clothes them up before I wash all kind of thing. Me now don't bed. Everything put on clean. Watch ya. They look dirty. Water for cook, we cook, drink. And in other weather, yeah, if you don't get water, it's like you stay flow. Yeah. So what about a mask? You're not wearing a mask. Is that important too? Well, yeah, wearing a mask, but it's how me smoking a weed. But in other weather, you really need some water. Trust me, boy. It's like a stay flint. Yeah. All right. Thanks a lot. Uh, no. So right about now is the worst experience I ever see in my whole life. I'd prefer a hurricane right now. Come and go. This is terrible. Did you experience the 1979 eruption? Yes, 1979, I remember. I was small, I was six years of age. All I could remember is just the dust. But I have no experience that it was blowing because I was too small to remember that. So now I experience it. I just can't, can't record what my grandparents them went through. I could record. That is all. The elders, what they went through. And the elders said this is worse than 1979. How have you been coping? Well, I've been coping a lot of stress, jogging a lot of water, and I'm having a lot of headache. And what is God's work? We cannot do nothing about it. I'm just helping out a little people there with the ash and the roof and thing. You know, because it's real ash in the place, and if the ash wet, you know, you could drop in your roof, so just a little helping out. 
And how, how many roofs have you cleaned for, to, for the day? Well, it's about like six. I clean my own and I come down the road and like helping out people and I clean like the road up this whole. Take up some fun off the road. Yeah, I'm a good thing. Are you being paid for this or are you just volunteering? Well, just collecting a little thing, but not really like for say nothing because it's just like a strength. It's just like a strength saying so go like really push to people for say like collect a lot of money from them. It's just like a little change. You do something for them and get a little change. I ain't got no problem with that. Can I ask you how old you are? No, 21. So you didn't experience 1979. So what is it like? What is it like for you to experience a volcanic eruption? Well, for me, I really, I really see nothing yet. Eh? But I just can't stand the dust. Cause I don't know it's plenty of dust. And so far as I hear, I ain't the thing is really done yet. So I can't say what. Kind of weird, surprising. I never really experienced it before. So. Are you gonna continue to clean house rules and whatever else? Well, yeah, well, tomorrow from tomorrow I'm coming down. Anybody want help, I go be doing it. No problem. So if anybody want the help, I will give them the help.